that just looks absolutely vile. This is Don't Fall number seven. This is obviously part seven in a, a big old series created by Mr. Chucky Nigrin. This is on MX Simulator. We are back today. I've done a couple of these in the past. However, this one looks to be like the busiest map, if that makes sense. It's the most going on. If we look at a top down view, look at there's just so much. Now, I tried being clever today. I tried seeing if I could copy and paste this over to MX Bikes, and I got it looking okay. However, you'll notice in some sections, so if we go right here, we have got actual like logs, so actual objects going across uh, from path to path. However, if we go over, this is what it looks like on the MX Bike side of things. So whilst the rest of the height map and stuff looks good, and we, it might be doable, I don't care how good you are at MX Bikes, I don't think you're getting across from here to here without any objects, so it would take a lot of time and effort. Obviously, it's not it's something I would just do myself, it's not something to be released, because I haven't asked permission to convert it. Maybe in the near future we'll get one for MX Bikes as well, it could be good fun. Um, but for now, however, we're going to try and do it in MX Simulator. I am being a bit of a wimp today, I'm being a bit of a pussy. I am doing the version that has uh, respawn points, so if we look at top down, all these points here that you see that are in, in green, they are ramps to respawn again. So say I, I do all these back and forth, back and forth, and then I fall, I'll go back to the beginning, get back on here, and attempt it again. But look, it's so long. I have no idea how long this video is going to take. But without further ado, let's let the pain and suffering commence. For all of you passionate gamers, you can now get 20% off all G Fuel products worldwide by using code LINS at checkout. And for any of you motorheads looking for some new drip or apparel, use code MXPR underscore LINS15, fxrracing.eu to get 15% off. All links and codes are in the description down below. Enjoy the video and drop a cheeky little like and subscribe. Right, so our first little obstacle here. It looks, I hate how it goes black like this. It's so difficult to see. It's just a game bug that I still don't know how to fix. There's something to do with graphics, but there's a little step on and a little step over and then a little step again. And then I think I can kind of stop and back it up. But you can see that the, ideally you want to hit this all in one go. But I've not played Sim in well over a month at this point. So my uh, my judgment of speed might be a little bit off. But uh, I mean, I mean, let's, let's just stop. Let's stop laughing around. Stop, stop being an idiot. Stop procrastinating. And let's just go for it. I am a little bit framey. On this today i'm not sure if that's because of just how uh spiky the height map is or what but uh, we'll see if it buffs itself out at all uh, so far oh wait am i on a i don't know if I... am i on a 250 right i am on a 250 oh this might be a terrible decision uh i don't know what bikes this map is built for usually i go on a 450 just for the ease just to have as much power as possible uh, but you know what we've already started now if i get to a point in the map where i just feel like i really can't do it on the 250 and i haven't got enough oomph not enough speed then i can probably just end recording do a cheeky little edit, hop on a 450, and then carry on again. But so far, so good. Ah, oh, so you can... Ah, oh, hang on a minute. I was about to hit this and just go through it as rollers. Now you have to bounce off each one, or you can take a detour and go round. Ah, mm, oh, that doesn't help. Okay. Uh, I'm going to go round. Some of you are going to hate me for that, but he's given us an easy way out. He's given us an option, because I have done them sorts of rollers there on the right in the past, and they are not easy. They take a lot of attempts. Let's just hit this bad boy. Nice. Motorcycle limbo. Is this a limbo? We got a... No way. Is it going to make it so it's going to hit your head on that? Surely not. Let's say motorcycle limbo or get risky and thread the needle. So I can either try and jump through the middle or I can try and scrub underneath it. That's a pretty cool concept. We're going to get this spun around. We're going to try and reverse as much as possible. I generally think I'm going to just try and jump in the middle. Because... It's a fairly big gap, I think. It's not a big gap. Oh, oh no, I, was, I just hit my head. It was so close. Oh, God, right. Okay, so now I've got to try to turn around and find my way back to where I was. I think I saw it on this. Is it on this right-hand side? Yeah, it is. Yeah, green is key. Green is key. All right, attempt number two. I think I'm just going to scrub it this time. Oh, there we go. Clean. Clean. Oh, a little bit technical in third person because you can't really see... <laughs> Can't really see uh, where oh, what you're aiming for, so you just have to guess. But so far, so good. This has been quite straightforward so far. I expected it to be a little bit more difficult, but I feel like I've probably fully. I feel like I've probably fully jinxed myself by saying that. I'm going to take a wild guess that there's no easy way to get back up from where I am. I don't think there is. I think I've got to turn around and hit the limbo again. I do. Oh god damn it! This is embarrassing. Oh, okay. Whew. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> that was that was a little bit too close for comfort. I'm not going to lie to you. There we go. 
much smoother this time. So I believe this is us going into the uh, into the maze in the middle. It, he's been an absolute absolute horrible man here by putting logs everywhere because now it's just going to be the most painful maze experience of our life. But uh, I'm going to go with the general rule of thumb where if you follow the left side of the maze all of the way, all the time, you will have eventually uh, covered every single side and you'll be fine. So I'm going to go round to the left. I'll probably time lapse this and, and speed it right up as well so you haven't got to sit here and watch me very, very slowly going over logs the entire time. Actually, it's quite a painful experience. Very slow. Ah, oh, and we're out, and freedom. Love that for me. Jeez, that took a little bit longer than expected. I probably could have scumbagged it, to be honest, and just not just not bothered going through it. So I am at the exit here. This is just a little, I guess, long extended dragon's back into Ascend, and then we've also got another little safety net there as a ramp as well. So it doesn't matter too much if we come up a little bit short. I am, oh, see a screenshot. I'm trying to look back as if I'm playing MX Bikes. Uh, I am, however, going to reverse as much as possible so we can get as much speed and as much oomph. And... Do, 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 do. Up and over. Lovely. We'll pretend we weren't uh, endo in there. If the jump was any bigger, I would have been on my cheeks. But we've reached another checkpoint, which is nice. So now if I fall to my demise, we should, keyword, should, should be okay. I think I need to get into the habit of just sending things harder rather than trying to be smooth. Because I never know how much speed that, I guess, kind of wall jump is going to going to rob from me if that makes sense but now we've got to do a couple of little uh little bum seat bounces here so and all good up and over that please don't fall off i beg okay phew okay okay i'm gonna try and line this up as straight as i can so i'm not still trying to turn at an angle that's about enough speed it's just a little cheeky little bum seat bounce then off the log round to the right oh is this the bit on the map where it's back and forth jump 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 oh it is okay um Oh no! Go on, get that. Yes, little tire tap. Um, okay, so we've hit another checkpoint, which is good. Uh, downside is this is probably where that 450 would have come in handy. Plus side is I think I can get away with just over jumping everything and still being okay. Yeah, I can. I can just OJ it and then hopefully I don't roll all the way off the edge. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah, okay. No, this is much easier than I thought. Shouldn't be too bad at all. I like so the, the, this all looks very intimidating when you come up to it. Then it's a lot. I'm off the left, aren't I? So I'm... no, ah! Oh! I was gonna say it's very intimidating when you come up to it, but then it's actually quite mellow when you hit them. It's not too bad. Come on, large boys, there we go. I was a little bit lost. I was a little bit lost trying to find the ramp. I'm hoping this is the one that I'm meant to be on, and we'll find out when we get to the top of this if this is the right one or not. And it is not right. Where on earth am I meant to go? So it's I hit that. Hit that, jump back that way, over there. Uh, hmm. I have no idea. Is it over here? <clears throat> I'm going to try and do some little scumbag. <laughs> Please don't fall off. Oh, I'm, I'm actually, I'm insane. I'm insane. I've scumbagged the course. I don't think you're meant to be able to do that at all, but we'll take it. That's one way of getting back to where I was before. I made a mental note of where the actual respawn point is for next time. But I need to hit the... Oh, my Jesus. I was about to say I need to hit these slower than I have been, but they're all varying sizes, so you can't just... It's not just one size fits all. Let's just land land on the front wheel. We'll just take that. We'll take the little topple over. That is absolutely fine. I do not mind that at all. And then you yeet. Oh, that's the cleanest one. Cleanest one so far. Smooth little transition. Round to the right. I think I just have to send this as hard as I can again. Yep. And then another 180 round to the left. This would be a bit of a um, a painful painful part to have to resell. Because you have to do all of that again. And if I just jump up here. There we go. We've got another little checkpoint. It's almost the highest point on the map. Pop a little pop a little UE. Pop a 180. No idea which side of this is best. We're just going to go on the right. Jump back over into the middle. Yeah, the 250 has not been a hindrance at all. It really hasn't. If anything, it's made it easier in some situations. Just where it's a bit lighter, turns a little bit easier. Uh... Oh, no. Oh. That was an L-gamer moment. We're going to not be an L-gamer this time. We're going to send this far enough. 
There we go, a little yaw yeet up and over that. Nice and gentle on the brakes. Motorcycle limbo part two, I can do that. There you go, part one. <laughs> that was actually really, really, really easy. I didn't expect to get that the first time. Thank God he didn't go too brutal with that, because if that was any lower, I think I would have uh, I think I would have clipped my head. But we go, oh God. I, I've chosen the narrower side somehow. I'm not a fan of that. The lighting's also making it look a bit narrower than it is, because there's a little bit on the right. You see where it's a slightly darker texture, so it looks like there's there's nothing there at all. We're just going to tiptoe our way through here, then jump back across. I like... Oh, another checkpoint. Love that. I'm really liking how he's kind of using all the space. Like it's all interweaving all over top of itself, which is nice. I don't think many of them in the past have done this to this extent. I think it's been the most fun one so far. I've got to jump all the way over here to some tyres. You can see as well why this wouldn't really work in its current form on bikes if I just moved the terrain over. There'd be some sections like this that were pointless because it would just be completely flat. Oh, little WhatsApp message. I apologise. And then there's some bits where you actually need like the logs and stuff. Oh, uh, oh, my Jesus. A little bit scared. I have no idea how far I'm going to go for this. Oh, it's fine. We can break in time. Yes, lovely. Pop another little 180. Round to the right. So I, I generally do believe in terms of, like it's not, it is really not as intimidating as it looks on the surface. So the jumps are much. First of all, I don't know how I'll survive that without crashing. Secondly, I keep jinxing myself. Yeah, the jumps are much more uh, much more mellow than I anticipated. How on earth? Where do I... Is it here? This is a difficult part, is trying to find where to get back up, because it is a little bit of a maze. I've just had to do such a big portion of the track again, because I couldn't find the closest checkpoint. Oh, God, right, we're back to where we were. So just a nice little mellow jump here. I'm going to just... I'm going to close my mouth this time, because I don't want to jinx myself again. I'm going to take it nice and easy. Nice and slow. Little little jump up. There we go. Now we've got oh, a little few platforms to jump down on. This could be difficult. Little hop, hop, hop again on the brakes. Nice and gentle. I hope there's not a gap at the top of this. Okay, it's not. Right. I need to pause here because I, ha I, I hate so much with this game when it does this. Uh, I need to try and find where I am because I don't know what's coming up next here. It should literally just be as simple as just a yogi up and over. Yes, lovely. Okay. So just a few little easy trails now, and then a little bit of a difficult log jump here. The only reason I say it's difficult, it's a small jump, but with the objects in this game, they do kick you in a little bit of a, a weird way. So just try and go as straight as possible. Yep, you see what I mean? Kicked me over to the right, even though I hit it in a straight line. Straight on the brakes. No need to uh, try anything too crazy. Oh god, how's this going to go then? It's probably going to take a few attempts. I will probably cut now to the one where I actually make it. I'm going to give it a go in first person. If this doesn't go well, then I'm scumbagging it next time. Oh, no. No, okay, yeah, I'm scumbagging it. L, L section. Oh my god, I hate it so much. And we go... Do, 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 do. Sorry, boys. I know you probably want to see me do that properly, but that is going to take forever up and over that. No problemo. Uh, I have no idea how long the track is meant to be. Like, I don't know what average times are. I'm not on any sort of a good time right now. Sorry, reason being. First of all, I had to stop and go for dinner halfway through this, but with the power of editing, you would never know. Uh, and then also, I've just been pausing it here and there. Oh, please don't be gaps. There's not gaps. Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God there was no gaps between those. I hate like, these big whoops. Well, I mean, whoops in general in this game, I really, really struggle with. Don't mind these little platforms though, just hopping, hopping off all the way down. Just got to get your speed right. Boing, boing, boing. And we got another little checkpoint here. That's going to be a tricky one to get back on and try and turn. And we're going back the other way. Up, and up, and up, and up, and up. All the way to the top. That was actually incredibly satisfying. There's a little, little vert wall. Oh, we've gone too far. Oh, how do I find my way back? You know, sometimes in life you just vert too hard, and clearly I need to just not pull back quite as much. I don't mind if I crash, I just want to actually land on the platform. Which we did, we're good, okay. Phew. wonder if you even get like a, a lap time at the end of this if you're playing on the version that has has respawns. I couldn't imagine trying to do this whole thing without crashing, because yeah, I've made... Well, I've probably fallen the most on this one out of any of these. There's There was one before that I think I've done where I've done it the entire time, first shot, which I... Looking back at it, I have no idea how. Because uh, yeah, my, my MX Simulator skills are... They're lacking, I would say. 
I would uh, definitely agree now to the point where, where we've done so much of this. 250 is not a like, negative impact on this track at all. I would genuinely say 250 is the way forward. It's another checkpoint as well. Caution, full hazard. Okay, well, I don't really want to really want to fall, Mr. Nigren. Uh, it's just nice and chill, nice and easy. Get the back end sliding around. I drop down and you know, yeet. Oh, that was clean. Uh, I, do I want to send? I do not want to send this. Nice. I want to send this though. Yeah, you know, yeet up to here. Little log section. We can double our way through. Oh, first one. Yes, second one though. Just get kicked all kinds of sideways. There's another vert wall there for whenever we get to it. That jumps around to the left instead of to the right. By the way, the skybox on this get on this track, beautiful. I don't know if I've ever seen a sky a sim skybox look as nice as this. So, uh, probably one of the most meme sorts of tracks you can get. Actually, looking very very pretty. All right, here we go. We're gonna pull back. Go on, rotate round. Yes, look at that. And another checkpoint. I'm flowing now, boys. We're racing the track. We're not just surviving. We are thriving. Oh, boys. Oh, sign me up for the Don't Fall Nationals. Jeez. Round to the right. Getting a little bit comfortable now. Maybe too comfortable. This is where things go wrong. Nope. And... Yeah, I definitely need to slow down. I'm getting too... I'm getting too confident. Oh, I was all going to go wrong. Uh, I can just send this next one by the looks of it. Because, again, I don't know how much this slows you down. And then going to hop up onto these tyres. Step off. That's a very, very unique section. That is cool. I'm just going to step onto this. I didn't want to go too far. Nice. Off. 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 I just I really enjoy these sorts of sections. It's just the little little hops jumping from from pad to pad. And I'm just gonna roll to the top of this. I don't wanna send it. I don't know if there's a hole afterwards. There is not. Oh what what is Uh I need to go and have a look at that. I think we're all the way over this side of the map. We are indeed. What on earth is this? So you, oh, so you've got a No, wait, wait what? Oh, okay, you jump all the way over onto this one here. Okay. I thought I had to land on this little narrow bit. So I either go left or right and hit a little wall transfer, or I try and step all the way up and over. But up and over looks really, really narrow. Uh... Oh, god damn. Where's the... If I look in the third person view... So I'm over here right now. So I've done that. Set rounds. Okay, so the next... The respawn is just before this. So I can afford... I can afford a couple of attempts. So I'm going to try and go round the side for the first attempt, just so I feel like it would look cooler than jumping all the way up and over. So, wish wish me luck. Luck not wished enough. So this time I'm just going to try and go dead straight in the middle. So I'm going to give myself a nice long run up to try and aim myself. Clean. I don't even mind if I crash here, we should survive. Yeah, lovely, easy stuff. Why didn't I just do that the first time? I get scared sometimes on the re really narrow bit. The uh, biggest reason being as well is I know this controller has got a little bit of stick drift on it, so uh, it will try turning me to left or right just a just a smidge. It's like I'm almost I'm trying to fight it the entire way. And then whoop. seat bouncing on this game is so satisfying. Just the little bunny ops you can do. That's a feature that. I... That is a feature that I do wish bikes had. Oh god, I've got to do the little. I've got to do the jump again. No. A backflip for the fans. Clean. Right, it should be easier the second time, surely. I can even go a little bit slower. No, I can't go slower. Oh, no. Oh, I'm such an idiot. I'm such an idiot. There we go. I think they kind of expect you to crash here, which is why it's such a wide landing platform. Thankfully, with the, uh, the power of sitting down, leaning forwards, and holding the rear brake all at the same time, we survived. So, do not hit this like a wimp this time. Nice and fast. Oh no. Hang on. There we go. Got scared a little bit there on that slide. A little on, off, off again. Careful. No, I'm just going to stop. Line myself up. Nice. On, 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 off again. Screw. 90 degrees to the left. And step up. I'm just going to try and go faster than I need to. Step off. Lovely. It's very kind of him to give us a little bit. Oh, we've got a little soupy section. I love that. I know full well there's going to be a hole in the middle one, isn't there? I'm waiting for it. No, there wasn't. Okay. Just a just a nice little soupy section in the middle of all of this chaos. I respect it. Do need to get my soupy, soupy practice on. My favourite uh, discipline in this game. Not a big Nationals guy on Sim. Do prefer my Supercross. 
just makes more sense to me. It's a lot smoother. Round to the left. Let's skirt. Double. See, these bits I find very, very easy. It's when it adds all the unique stuff like limbo and things like that that it's just it's a little bit of a challenge because it's something that I just never faced before. But these you can you can kind of get a rough idea of how fast you're going. It looks like we have another checkpoint here. If I can make it all the way around, you can definitely cheat and jump across here. But I'm not gonna not gonna scumbag it too much. I feel like I've already done enough scumbaggy moves so far in this run by uh, like missing out on the the loop de loop, for example. Oh, careful! And then wait, is, is this a finish? No, no, not just yet. Okay. Oh. Screw again. I just I love how powerful the back break is as well, so you can just hit the yo yeet. Just pop a full full 90 degree if you want to. Well, it's a bit further than it looked at originally, that's fine. See I do I can do this stuff all day long. Find this stuff. Where on earth Wait, is that I was about to say where on earth do I go to go back, but there's there's one here, but it's not green. Chucky, you missed one. What's going on? L track creation. Okay, I missed one jump out there. Don't hate me for it. Oh, oh smooth. I'm not even going to call it Dragon's Back. Just uphill rollers. I'm off, I'm off, I'm off, I'm off, I'm off, I'm off, I'm off. No, no. Ah! It's all right. We'll go back to that same checkpoint. There we go. We're back. Oh, yeah, the hardest bit is trying to find your way back to the checkpoints because you just, you can't, there's no, like, map at all. I think there's a map on the version without respawn points, but... Oh, not on here. Oh my goodness. Okay. Dangerous cliff edge. Okay. I mean, I don't plan on going there. We've got another checkpoint, which is nice. I need to keep a mental note of where that is located. And we're on off. He's trying to be... He's trying to be a meanie here. He's trying to put sideways logs that he knows is going to cause some weird... Weird physics. It's all right. Minor enduro... Enduro-ness is coming out. We'll step over. Nice. Big step over. Glad I didn't overjump that one too much, or that would have been uh, a rest in peace. Over, dab the back break. And another one. And screw. I think mean, this has been my most enjoyable one so far, because you can get a, oddly enough, you get a flow going around here, which I wouldn't expect from a map like this. Round to the right. Step on. And slow down. It will pop up and over. Just dump the clutch. Give it a little yeet. A little yeet -cus. Ooh. Ooh. Wait, 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 is that a... Hang on. Wait just a darn second. Am I... Where am I? Uh, this is the hardest part. Okay, right, it's good that I didn't just send that. So, oh, you can go... Where on earth does... Oh, so it's just a step up to here. That is not a very big room for error. Error, error. So where is the nearest respawn point in case I get this very, very wrong? Which I'm probably going to, once or twice. Around here, so it's up this bit so if i fall right noted okay i've got to put it in reverse actually it's gonna take a little while Whew, okay go 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 oh that was actually fine i hyped, hyped some of these things up way too much but i don't know how the ramps uh i don't know how the freestyle ramps going to react when i hit it originally you saw it was like really really choppy going up it but it was it was all right it went to I'm hoping that as the bike stands up, it doesn't fall off. Lovely. And then I'm just going to sit here and just do like a, a 20 point turn. Lovely. Double out. Nice. Step up again. We've got to be close to the finish now. I mean, look how much we've done. Just absolutely sprawl. Hmm. Just hanging out. Just waiting for a mate. Would you believe me if I said that I tried to do that just then? Because I feel like some of you would say, no, you're capping. But I actually tried banking off of the <laughs> banking off the wall. Now, how do I get... Mm, oh, I could be naughty. I could try and jump across here and then turn around and transfer over. So up here, yes. Oh, actually, I don't know if I can transfer back over to the... Over to here? No, I... Surely not. Oh my god, the Sim Rider has got the most powerful legs in the world. That's actually ridiculous. And we're safe again. Lovely stuff. Oh my god. Right, send it even more this time. Yo, yeet. Lovely. 
and step off. Lovely. Another big send. I am going to eat shit here, but I should stay on the track, which we did. Nice. I was eyeing up this section when we was flying around at the start as well. There doesn't seem to be any any random holes anywhere. Just nice, normal, normal track. Oh god, I got scared when I hit that for a second. Then I thought I might have just jinxed myself. Right, we'll go up here. It's all of the uh, all the blind stuff scares me on this. I just don't know what's on the other side. It's like, is he going to be nice? Is he going to fill it in, or is there going to be a random hole that just sends you to your demise? I mean, he could have put random holes here along it if he wanted to. Hmm. Is that a send? I think it looks like a. It, it does look like a send. Hang on. Wait, is it a send? Yeah, send up and over. Yeah, okay. For some reason, I thought you might have to transfer and like downside the uh, the jump to the right, but no, I'm being an idiot. It was just uh, the only reason I thought that is because of how steep the jump faces. I'm a little bit scared. Please don't fall off to the right. Oh god. Okay. We are threading the needle. You're joking. What? How on earth do I get back there? I wish you could set respawn marks on this game. It would take a lot of the frustration out of these maps. Oh my. Okay. Right. Let's try. Please no. Right. I need to hit this with so much more speed this time than last time. There we go. Please no. Oh, you're joking. You're joking. That's incredibly annoying. I just took another little pause break. And I forgot to press the record button. So I've literally just got over it. It is behind me, the jump. But I just failed twice. So we're going to go again from this point. God damn, that, that little black bit there is very annoying. So now we need to uh, oh, hit the rest of it. I'm just going to land on my head. Hopefully the bike lands in the right way, which it did. Lovely. Yeah, I've got no idea how long's left this. So like, it's, it's got to be the longest one by far as well. And I think it's just because of how much it goes back and forth over itself. But it takes absolutely ages. We've got another checkpoint there. How big is this? Might actually time that pretty damn good, if I do say so myself. And then you're yeet. We've got to be close. I mean, we're going back over to the corner of the map where we started. So that fills me with some confidence. It'll step down. Please don't. Right, okay. I'll, I'll take that. I'll take that. How? Wait. There's no way it... it we're, hit, we're jumping this jump in front of me here, all the way to the top of that. There's, surely there's not enough room. Hmm. 250, don't fail me now. <laughs> okay, no, there's plenty of room. Lovely. I mean, the start is here. Is You can see the gates right in front of me. So if there's just one more little little back and... Back and forth! Back and forth! Oh. <laughs> yes. Yo, yeets. Oh, no, have I gone forwards enough? No! Why did I, why did I press reverse? What's wrong with me? No joke, it's literally taking me over five minutes to get back to this point again. Just to be able to give this another attempt because I'm such an L gamer. Uh, like, trying to navigate your way, once you're down onto the, like, the ground level, trying to navigate your way around this place is insane. Especially when I keep getting all of the weird black box uh, glitches, so I can't even use the map properly when I tab into the track edit edit mode. And then... All the way up. Clean! I even tried looking for a way that I could do a sneaky transfer or something like that, but I just I just couldn't. It didn't it didn't exist. Please don't go all the uh, I think knowing that I'm so close is probably the most painful thing. And the fact that I just keep getting to that last bit and crashing, and it takes so long to get back to this part of the map, because I'm just like I'm in between checkpoints that are really, really far apart. Ah, uh, come on, down, down, down. Yes, power, 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 all the way to the top. It's going to crash. Should be okay. It is okay. Now, don't send this too far. Nice. Step off. Step off. Step over really fast. Should downside this nicely. We did. Double. Okay, come on. Just take your time. No need to rush. Nice and gentle. Line it up. Jump in a straight line. Break again. Line it up. Jump in a straight line. Gentle. Very gentle. Oh, this is stressful. This is stressful. Oh, right. This is a checkpoint. So if I crash, I'm coming back to here. I wanted to, I didn't want to like cut out bits of the track at all last time, but now I've hit, I should be okay. Right. Careful again. Little, little plop. 
very gentle. This should, 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 should be okay. These ones stress me out though, because it can just kick you over the bars and then you're at the mercy of wherever your bike wants to actually roll to. And give this another attempt. Okay. Okay. How big is this? I don't know how big this jump is. I am not risking it. I'm not just sending it into like a hole. Coming all the way over here. All the way over. Right, there's nothing on the other side. And then a big old centre to the finish. No, right, easy. Light work. Right, light work. So roll over this. Yep. And then should be the finish line. Backflip for the fans. I've overjumped it. Don't care. I've done it. It's done. This has taken literally about an hour and a half of my life. I'm finished. Hope you've enjoyed. Catch you guys next time. Jesus Christ. I'm working hard. I'm sacrificing my life. I'm sacrificing my mind. I'm sacrificing my sanity. But most importantly, I'm sacrificing my time. Boy, I feel fine. I feel like I am a king. Honestly, I can't complain. Even with faith that's the size of a grain of some salt, I will still move a mountain and do what I want. I got salt.